What's up everyone, I'm back to talk to another video, now with this one, I'm reviewing Chucky Season 2. Now I'm a huge fan of the Child Safe franchise, and Chucky is my second favorite horse slasher, close to Michael Myers. Um, but sometimes both of them go neck and neck. I enjoy both of those slasher franchises a lot. So yeah, now for this video I'm reviewing Chucky Season 2. Now recently, this was my first time watching this season, um, um I watched bits and pieces on, you know, YouTube and stuff, bits and pieces of clips, and I thought it kind of looked a little goofy, right? Um, but when I watched this season, um, I thought it was better than the first season because I thought the first season was, season was just okay for what it was. But yeah, but I really do enjoy this season. Is it perfect? No. But, and I'll get into that in a little bit. Now, what I will say that the characters in this film. I do enjoy, you know, I the characters kept me invested in what's going on um, with this season. So, yeah, in the season, the characters were fleshed out almost perfectly, and the kills were great, and some of the comedic moments, you know, worked, and a lot of it didn't, but some of it did. Um, so, yeah, and... And, you know, there's some twists and turns at the final episode of season two, um, which is I kind of do enjoy, kept you wanting more, you know. But from what I've heard, they're bringing Chucky back to his horror roots. Like, season three is going to be like the scariest season yet, which is, I don't know if that's going to be true or not, because this season, um, it's still kind of turned Chucky into a joke, and I'm going to get to that now. So. I already talked about the positives, like the kills are great, the characters were entertaining and great. Now, and also, I enjoyed the setting this film was in, you know. Um, so, yeah, but now I'm going to cut to the negatives, and there's quite a few. Now, I want Chucky to be terrifying again. That's what I want. You know, I want the feeling of the child say one and two, even three, and somewhat proud of Chucky, you know, there's a lot of comedic moments there, but it still kept Chucky pretty creepy in Bride of Chucky, and then also I wanted that feel of Curse of Chucky, which is, like, they kind of brought it back to its horror roots, but, of course, Colt the Chucky comes around, and then Colt the Chucky kind of brought Chucky back to its comedy roots again, like, it's, it's comedy, and this film, I mean, this season, they kind of, like, even season one, they kind of did, you know, made Chucky a joke again. Um, and I don't really appreciate that, you know, buff Chucky, really. Like, there's some interesting stuff that could have done to make it creepy. Like, literally, there's some scenes with buff Chucky that you're like, oh, this could be interesting and creepy. But they went downhill. Like, it fell flat. Like, you know, there's a scene where they, you know... These characters, or, you know, the good Chucky, so to speak, kills the buff Chucky. And you got this one woman, you know, there's a scene that could have been really done well, you know, to where Chucky could have freaking got out of there and then killed her. And you could have had an epic jump scare in this one scene because there was, like, a tension that looked like it was going to build up, but it just didn't go nowhere, so... There's a lot of things in the season that I would have been like, oh, that could have been interesting. Oh, that could have been in interesting. But a lot of it fell flat. Um, it is better than the first season. I will say, in my opinion, it is better than the first season, in my opinion. But I wish they would just make Chucky terrifying again. Like, I like to be scared of Chucky. I don't want to be laughing at him. I want to be terrified. You know, because when I was growing up, when I watched the first, Child Slay, even the first two Child Slay movies, which is my favorite out of the franchise, um, those are somewhat creepy in ways. Even the second film was creepy. The first two made me scared of Chucky as a kid. Um, and we don't get that anymore. Now Chucky's just a complete joke in a way. So this film, I, I'm kind of mixed. I mean, not this film, this season, this season, I'm kind of mixed on. Um, I'm kind of mixed on, 
you know, I kind of like it, I kind of don't at the same time, like, I'm in the middle, it's not perfect, it's better than the first season, but this film does have some action-packed moments with Chucky, and when good Chucky turns evil again, that was awesome, you know, um, it's almost like Chucky was playing him the whole time, there's some confusing stuff in the season, there's some, like, wacky and weird, confusing stuff in this season. Um, and, of course, leave it off with the cliffhanger because, of course, season um, three is coming out soon. And I think that, um, you know, there's it's like there's only one Chucky left. There might be only one Chucky left, and that gives him a chance to bring it back to its scary roots. Because as much as I like multiple Chuckies, um, as much as I like multiple Chuckies, one Chucky makes it creepier. If there's like one Chucky because you got that suspense, Chucky could be hiding over there and all this stuff. So season three might be the scariest um season yet. And I hope it does. I hope season three ends up becoming the scariest season um of the Chucky show. So yeah, if I had to rate this season, I would give it a seven out of ten. Um it's all right, you know. I I will I would watch it again. I would watch this again. And there are some dark moments. Don't get me wrong. There are some dark moments, like where you know it, it starts off with like um, Andy driving that Andy driving, and then um, and then he comes off a cliff, you know. And then the Chucky try to attack him, and he comes off the drives off a cliff. And then, later on down the season, these Chucky grabbed Andy and pretty much made him suffer for a whole year. Now, that's some dark shit right there. And then, when Andy got up, they, they started giving me chills because Andy's like, I'm going to hump for that motherfucker, you know? And I'm like, oh, shit, here we go. You know, so there are some great moments. That's why I didn't hate the season. I just thought it was an okay season. I enjoyed it for what it was. It's a 7 out of 10. Um... And the first season, I would probably give it a 6.5 out of 10, but I'll give this a 7. Um, very enjoyable season, but it wasn't perfect. So, yeah. Let me know in the comments below. What do y'all think of Chucky Season 2? Do you like the season? Do you hate the season? I'd like to hear y'all's thoughts down below. So, yeah. I guess that's it for this video. If y'all enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. Please subscribe and share. And also hit the bell. So you know when new videos upload. Peace out. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. I guess I'm out. Peace.